Guys, what's up? It's Justin Mark, and right now I'm here with Nick Dora. And guys, in this video, we're gonna talk to you about how to know if a woman likes you. How do you know if a girl likes you? How do you know if a woman is attracted to you? So I'm an international dating coach and relationship expert. Nick is an absolute seduction savage. Uh, and um, yeah, basically the nature of my job was figuring out if people like you so that when you go and talk to them, you have you know a greater chance of making income. All right, so that on top of years of picking up, you know, both of us have mastered the skill. All right, dedicating the last seven years of our life to it steady. Yeah, so I've been doing actually pick up for this would be actually my ninth year. Okay, I started in 2013. So it's been like eight full years. And it, it's actually insane because uh, I dedicated my life to traveling around the world, meeting people, being social, and figuring out psychology and social skills. And, you know, the two of us possess this incredible expertise to just know off the bat if someone likes you. Today I was at the park walking my little dog, Taco. Okay, he's actually my roommate, Alfredo's dog. And uh, Taco's a you know, really sweet dog. And I saw this gorgeous woman. And actually, I swear I knew this girl. Like me and Nick definitely met this girl out at a club like six, seven years ago. She was hot as fuck. And I told her, hey, I like your dog. And she says, hey, I like your dog. And it was almost like me saying, hey, I like you. And her saying, hey, I like you too. And I, I got nervous and ran away. <laughs> this girl was so fucking hot. And in, in the moment, like I hadn't really warmed up for the day. Even though I've been doing this for many years and I had killer results, and I probably have to like, like five or six women this week. I had a threesome the other night with two hot girls and I was still nervous when I see a gorgeous woman in front of me on the street and she's into me, right? But I knew she likes me. And so in this video, we're gonna talk about how to know if a girl likes you, how to actually capitalize on opportunities so you don't do what I did. I literally ran away. Uh, Cause like truth be told, um, I had another girl in my uh, room waiting for me to come back from walking the dog. And so I was just like in my head, you know, I just woke up for a nap and all these things going on. And, and like, how do you end up in a situation where you can meet girls, know they like you and actually execute. And so me and Nick were actually just on the street, walking down the street. And again, after, you know, that experience, I, I called Nick. I'm like, dude, we need to go out and make sure we build momentum, stay in the momentum. Even though we're seeing girls, you know, Nick has a girlfriend. I have women I'm seeing. It's like, how do you make sure you stay on momentum and keep those social skills tight and be able to execute on opportunities when they present themselves so you can bring amazing people into your life and have these amazing win-win relationships, right? And so we went out and we actually met a girl together on the street, got her Instagram and she's stunning. And she said, hey, I have a cool roommate. The four of us can get drinks sometime. Awesome, right? And, and so let, let's jump into it, Nick. And let's talk a little bit about how, how a, a man can know when a woman likes you. I mean, I notice right away in the eyes, okay? If you're walking down the street and you know, you're looking at the floor, you can't tell all of these girls passing by you what like the indication of interest, the IOIs, if you will. Girls will immediately check you out. They'll size you up real quick, very quickly. They're very crafty with this. So they'll look up and down and then they'll look deep into your eyes, okay? And if you're not paying attention, then you will miss this. So that's kind of like an opening, that's an in. You can use that as a number one indicator. So what Nick just pretty much explained was indicators of interest. It's a way that you know, you have an indicator that, you know, the person you're talking to is interested in you. So it could be eye contact, it could be smiling, it could be body language, it could be, you know, certain patterns of behavior. It could be, uh, you know, even a conversation, right? For example, walking my dog, girls staring at me, smiling, saying, I like your dog, standing there waiting for me. It, essentially, she was like waiting for me to further the conversation. Mm -hmm. And I anxiously was like, <laughs> ran away. The you know what I mean? welcoming tone of voice kind of like draws you in and she's like waiting for a reply. She's waiting for you to engage and like just being in your head like, oh, oh my God, ah, this is going well. Must sabotage and peace out. <laughs> and so like even me doing this for years, the reason I actually coach and teach guys this is so I can actually continue practicing myself, right? Otherwise, you know, those anxieties come back and you gotta realize that these indicators from interest are actually an opportunity for you to move forward, right? Instead of being nervous and in your head, you actually push forward, push forward the interaction because as long as you are a man who's charismatic, developing himself, confident, go-getter, uh, you know, carrying himself with a high degree of class, dressing well, you know, naturally women are gonna be attracted to you because simply put, you're a man, they're a woman, and it's human nature and biology, right? For you to be attracted to that and for them to be attracted to you so you want to you know figure out what these indicators are and it, there's so many okay we can really break it down but the, the biggest one is body language which could be facial expressions 
and you know, the way they're acting towards you. Uh, nervous gestures too. Like I notice the girl will just suddenly put her hair behind her ear. Like it's always just to kind of present herself and make her look a little bit more appealing, a little bit more, you know, kept. And like, it's just so subtle, but I'll just like observe like my buddies or like you in a set and I'll just see a girl instantly do this. Like basically all of them, if they're like feeling you, they'll just go to that, you know, something like that kind of like indicates even like the position of their feet, you know, is it open or is it like kind of turned to the side a bit? Like they're getting ready to walk away, like, but just kind of over their shoulder, listening to what you have to say, like little subtle cues. If you look at all of them, you know, like a pattern will indicate either interest, uh, indifference or disinterest. And so what you have to do as a man is you have to go out and actually experience this. You have to meet people. You have to be social. You have to interact with lots and lots of different people. And what that will allow you to do is over time build up the social awareness. So when you're you know, having a social interaction, whether you're in a bar talking to a cute girl at the, at the bar or the club, or you're in some sort of business situation, well, you can actually figure out what the situation is, reading body language, reading facial expressions, reading tonality and vocal projection and voice patterns, right? You'll actually be able to understand this over time. And you'll also get good overall as a skill set of just understanding how people work and what makes them tick. And the best part is you'll actually be able to bring out more interest in doing so. And the thing is, when you're in set, girls, if they're feeling you, they'll make it extremely obvious that they like you, okay? They'll almost guide you through the seduction. They'll give you little clues, little pointers, little tips, very subtly to kind of help you move things towards a more intimate direction, okay? So they'll touch you on the shoulder, they'll laugh at jokes or most things you say, you know? They'll just have this like childlike expression of just like awe oh. and their pupils will actually dilate and grow, you know, which is meaning that they're releasing oxytocin and like pair bonding chemicals, like little things like that. If you know what to look for, girls will literally lead you through the seduction if they like you. They'll make it easier on you. But here's the thing, they'll never be like straight up. Like as, yeah. as a man, you're very logical probably and you're probably gonna be like, hey, like I like you, do you like me? And so oftentimes, like if I can't tell if a girl likes me because you know they'll play with their hair and they'll do these things, right? And again, they'll guide you through it because it's a slow and steady process. But uh, honestly, I'll, I'll just straight up ask the women in my life, like, hey, do you find me attractive? Like, are you into me? I, that's one thing I love to do is say, hey, like I find you attractive, do you find me attractive? Like, are you into me, right? And you can slow play it and kind of escalate in a very slow, respectful and consensual way where she feels safe, comfortable and respected every step of the way. Whether it's you asking her on a date, taking her to a cool venue, uh, you know, even going for a kiss or something along those lines, right? So you want to be completely respectful and consensual the entire time, but you also want to, you know, use logical indicators of interest, use logical indicators of intent to, you know, demonstrate, hey, I logically like you, right? But also in your body language, in your facial expressions, show that you like her, right? So you can give her the seduction eyes and maybe she'll give it back. You can give her the, you know, cute smile and maybe she'll give it back. And, you know, just the fact that you're talking to her for hours and she hasn't made an excuse to leave and she's actually talking to you back for hours, even if she's not that vocal, or like, you know, engaging conversations. The fact that she's physically there with you for like, let's say five plus hours may indicate that she's interested, but maybe she's too shy to like socially banter with you. So it takes a little bit more opening up. The fact that she's still physically there with you, you know, indicates that there is some level of interest. She has other places to be, like you're assuming she, she could be with any other guy, but she's still physically there with you for hours on end. That's a pretty good indicator that she's, you know, about it, she's into you. So guys, that's the gist of it. Go out, be social, be confident, be a go-getter, be charismatic. And you want to study what these indicators are. You want to study body language. You want to learn and not just like logically reading it from books or YouTube videos, but actually like experiencing life, right? Coming out and learning this stuff in person. Me and Nick are both dating coaches uh, based out of Toronto, Canada, and we teach this in person, in field, and we teach it at the highest absolute highest level in ways you wouldn't even imagine. So if you're ever in Toronto and want to come to a live coaching program with us or boot camp, you can just message uh, Nick on Instagram. It's Nick Dora or you can message me on Instagram at drunk Justin too. And uh, we're always here to help you guys out. And uh, guys, it's so much fun chatting with you guys. Make sure to leave a thumbs up on this video. Make sure to like this video if you learned a thing or two. Make sure to subscribe. Click the bell notification so you're notified of new videos. And we'll see you guys very soon in a new video. Talk to you soon. My name is Justin Mark. Nick Dora. Peace out. Peace out.